Signing in one Portuguese player every season until Wolves are Champions League winners. And as you can see on the top left, we have Jorge Mendes because it just makes sense that he's the manager. But boys, what is the criteria for this video? Who can we sign? But boys, as long as they're Portuguese in game, that's all that matters. Okay, boys, there are only two rules in this video. We can only sign one Portuguese per season. And if we already have Portuguese players in the squad, they have to be in the lineup. The only exception I'm making it is Chiquinho because his spots are already taken. So boys, as you can see in the starting 11, we're only missing two Portuguese players to have a full Portuguese lineup. However, that does not mean we're only signing two players in this video. We're gonna continue signing players, trying to sign better Portuguese players until we win the Champions League. Okay, boys i'm gonna release a couple players that way only the portuguese players play in this video boys i have realized we do have vinagre out on loan so we have brought him back okay boys now since officially connor cody is the only non-portuguese player we have to sign our center back in the first season no cheat engine for money will be used today we are starting with 52 million let's see who we can buy i think it's only right we sign the best youngster in portugal that is a center back okay boys in the first season we actually have a full 11 of portuguese players but taking a look at our squad depth it's pretty trash considering we have a low rated center back and we have to release everyone but boys the first immediate goal is to get wolves into the Champions League but more importantly is to survive this season because looking at this team it's not very good so far but go ahead and put development plans on all of our Portuguese players because that is important okay boys season number one we have signed Insao so let's go ahead and sim to the end of the season and let's see how this Wolf side this Portuguese side more importantly performs to be honest I'm expecting a bad season uh, we have no squad depth whatsoever okay boys it's the end of season one come on let's just survive relegation okay boys taking a look we did not relegate which is pretty good so a mid table finish should be realistic and yeah 11th place it's not too bad okay boys come on somehow did we win any of the cups i swear if i see burnley win another trophy in my video i'm gonna lose it Carabao cup come on boys give it to me and no we're not but boys let's go ahead and take a look how this wolf side is looking like okay boys we have had pretty decent growth all around this gomez guy went up a plus five fabio silva went up a plus five so they didn't count but sadly he's going back to barca Coutinho did end up going down so we're either gonna sign a center mid or a right winger i, I might have to sign Trincao back or another center mid because we don't have any other portuguese center mid we do have Chiquinho in the bench so he will probably take over Trincao for at least the season but boys in seo yes i said it wrong in the beginning of the video has improved a lot as well okay boys who was the top goal scorer at I think it has to be Pedro Neto, right? And it was Trincao with 15 goals, Fabio Silva right behind him with 14, and Pedro Neto with 10. Disappointing season from Daniel Polens. I thought he'd do better. And top assist wise was given to our captain, Ruben Neves. <laughs> okay, boys, season number two, I, I think I have to go for that sentiment because Moutinho is going to start going down a lot. But before we do that, we have to release a lot of players because they came back from loan. Okay, boys, this season we have 110 million. Should we go for someone expensive or should we go for a youngster? Boys, I think it's obvious. He won the Euros of Portugal. He was a Golden Boy winner. We have to sign Renato Sanchez for this team. Okay, boys, 70 million has brought in Renato Sanchez into the team. Like I said, we did lose Trincao because he went back to Barca, but we have Chiquinho. Hopefully, he does decent. And yes, boys, I know I probably should have signed another center back, but you know what? We needed a center mid because Coutinho is going down. Another season, another Portuguese player. So let's go ahead and sip to the end of the season. We finished in 11th last season. Let's see if we can improve just a little bit. I mean, boys, we basically have the whole Portuguese national team in our squad except CR7, so it should go pretty well. Okay, boys, end of season two. I'm ready for the supercharged season. Okay, boys, I'm just hoping above 10th place. If we finish 10th, 9th, or 8th, I'll be okay with it. But I don't think we made it into like the Champions League or the Europa League or something like that. So let's scroll up. Okay, we're in the top 10, top 8. Yes, we are. Top 6. Boys, there's no way we're in the top 4, right? We're in the top 4. We're actually in the Champions League already. We can possibly win this video next season. 4th place. No. No, we didn't win the league, right? We didn't win the league. Yeah, we didn't. Okay, 3rd place with 77 points. Missed out on the league by 12 points. Amazing season by the Wolf side. Come on, boys. We have to win at least a cup. FA Cup, come on, give it to us. No, it doesn't really matter anyways. But Carabao Cup, no. Okay, boys, it's time to look at this amazing Portuguese team because they got 3rd place. Okay, boys. I think I know why we finished in the top 4. Jose size 87. Wow, man. Amazing growth from the side. As Ignacio is already in 85. This Claudio Gomez guy is 75. Not too bad. Our fullbacks are both 82. While Renato Sanchez grew to an 85. Nevis is one off 90. Tony's had a good season this year. Growing actually this time. Plus four. Reggio Neto out an 84. Chiquinho went up to a 78. While Fabio Silva is now at an 80. Okay, boys. It's time to look at the stats. Who was the top goal scorer? Is it this time going to be Pedro Neto? And... It was Chiquinho, the what the worst player in the side, the second worst player in the side, got top goal scorer. Juneto up close in second place with 18 goals, while Fabio Silva is right there also with 13. Shout out to Ruben Neves, the captain, also getting 10 goals from a center mid position. As for top assists, once again, it was Ruben Neves and Daniel Polens and Pedro Neto liking behind him. But boys, what an amazing season. We could possibly end the video in the next season. Let's go ahead and see who we sign next year. <laughs> 
Okay, boys, season number three. As much as Fabio Silva has grown, I think we're still lacking goals up top. 199 million in the bank. Let's see what superstar we can sign. Okay, boys, we're going to try our best. I don't know if we have enough money to sign Joao Felix already in season number three. He is the best Portuguese talent in FIFA 22, so we need him in the team. Okay, boys, we couldn't sign Joao Felix, so you know what? We're going to go for Mr. CR7. Okay, boys, signing Cristiano Ronaldo is a huge achievement. However, he's already 38. However, he is still riding high, though. 38 years old, 88 rated. He's still going to carry this side. I wanted the long term fix, and the best fix in the game is to sign Joao Felix. But you know what? We have an easy fix. Maybe we can win the Champions League this season with Mr. Champions League in the squad. Hey boys, season number three and we signed Cristiano Ronaldo. We're also in the Champions League. So let's him to the end season and let's see if somehow, some way, we can win the Champions League with Wolves in three seasons. Okay boys, it's the end of season three. Let's see how far Mr. Champions League took us in the Champions League. Okay boys, as long as we finish top four, that's all that matters because we need to be in the Champions League next season or if we won the Europa League somehow if we drop down. But as we scroll up, we are in the top four so that all that matters and we missed out on the title by a point though. FA Cup, Carabao Cup, we don't care too much about it but then we win one no man city won that one and man united won that one okay boys in this video this is all that matters how we did in the champions league group c come on boys did we finish in first or second and first place in a pretty tough group round of 16 who do we face let's go ahead and check and we beat wolfsburg 5-1 on aggregate quarterfinals we beat no, we lost to Liverpool, 5-1. Okay, boys, take a look at this squad. It's absolutely amazing. Cristiano went down, but he's still at an 86, which is not too bad. Amazing scenes to see. Ruben Neves at an 82. Jose Sa at an 89. And Inacio at an 88. You know what, Gomez? This Gomez kid has done pretty well. You know what? 78 rated is not too bad. Melo still grows, even though he's a little bit older, while Vinagre is now at an 84. And the likes of Pedro Neto at an 88. Chiquinho at an 82. Potence at an 86. And Renato Sanchez at 86. Is not too bad. Silva even grew, even though he was on the bench, to an 84, which is not too bad. Okay, boys, I think next season I'm aiming for another center back because even though Gomez has done well, we still need someone else. Our top goal scorer this year, come on, if it's not CR7, I'm gonna lose my stuff. And of course, it's gonna be Mr. CR7, 23 goals at 39 years of age. Pedro Neto right behind him, though, with 22 goals. Chiquinho once again shining with 16 goals. And once again, Mr. Consistency, Mr. Captain, Nuruba Neves with 11 goals. Not only that, but he achieved 15 assists. Brilliant progress in season number three. Let's go ahead and win it all in season number four okay boys season number four we have an amazing squad and like i said we have to go for that center back okay boys with 264 million i think i know who we have to sign man yes boys we have to sign the best center back in the world ruben diaz boys after a lot of offers we have signed ruben diaz shout out to gomez but ruben diaz is now in the squad boys this team i believe is unstoppable now we should be winning the champions league now okay boys i think season number four might be the one in the wonder kid video we may have gone 10 seasons but i think this one will be way shorter but come on boys cr7 ruben diaz ruben nevis oh my god boys this squad is stacked let's go ahead and win the champo okay boys it's the end of season number four i think this season is the one okay boys as we scroll up as long as we're in the top four we shouldn't be worried and Barely we made it into the top four. Okay, boys, we're in the community shield. Let's see if we won that. And yeah, we have, but that doesn't matter though. FA Cup, did we win it? Okay, that's a double so far. Can we get a domestic treble even though it doesn't matter? No. Okay, boys, Group C. Group C meaning Champions League winners. Come on. And okay, we made it in first place, beating Porto, round of 16. We beat Hoffenheim 4 2, quarterfinals. We have beaten Inter. We have never gone this far in this video yet. Semis. Boys, we're in the final against Barcelona. Please tell me we won it. No, boys. 3-2 in the final. It was the golden opportunity. But boys, take a look at the squad. CR7 is at an 83, but it's okay. We have Fabio Silva waiting at an 86. Pedro Neto is now at a 90. Chiquinho, I don't even know who this guy is, is at an 86. Potent's about to reach a 90. Renato Sanchez, 3 off a 90 as well. Ruben Neves, 93. Jose Sa now at a 90. Inacio at a 90. Ruben Diaz, 92. Vinagre, 89. And Semedo at an 85. At this point, man, I have no idea who to sign. And if you guys are still interested in Gomez, he is now at an 80 rated. Not too bad for a backup center back. Okay, boys, our team is perfect, but we still have not won it. Goals, who was the top goal scorer? And it was Fabio Silva with 31. Chiquinho with 25 goals as well. Pedro Neto with 22. Daniel Pony is right there as well with 11. Top assist, it was Pedro Neto this time, not Ruben Neves. Okay, boys, this was our best season yet. At this point, I don't know who to sign, but let's go to next season and see who we can find. Okay, boys, season number five, and I don't know who to sign, man. I, I think I think we have to push for Joao Felix once again. I know Fabio Silva is at an 86, but we have to push for Felix. Boys, with 262 million, let's hope that's enough for Joao. Boys, we have done it. Joao Felix has joined the side. It took 227 million plus Cristiano Ronaldo. Yes, he is gone from the squad, but we have signed the best Portuguese player in FIFA 22. And I say that because he grows to an amazing growth of at least 91. Okay, boys, season number five is the one where we finally win the Champions League and end the video.
Okay, boys, season number five has to be one, surely, man. For the first time in this video, we win the league title, so that's a plus. Community Shield, did we win that as well? Yes, back to back, that's two trophies so far. FA Cup, no. And as for the Carabao Cup, we have won a domestic treble, but that doesn't matter because this video is about the Champions League. Okay, boys, this time being in Group F, then we go on to the round of 16, and yes, boys, with 14 points, round of 16, it's speed run. I think we have won it, surely. Napoli, okay, 6 3, quarterfinals. We beat Man City 5 1, semis. We barely be at the goal. We're against Liverpool in the final. Come on. Surely we have won it and... Bruh. No, boys, again. In the final, back to back. And we can't win it. Boys, what else can I do with this team here, bro? Joe Felix went down, but that's okay. He's still out of 90. Chiquinho's out of 90. Pedro Neto's out of 91. Podence is out of 90. Neves out of 93. Renato Sanchez out of 88. Diaz, 93. Inacio, 91. Inagri out of 91. A left back at 90 plus. Semedo is the lowest rated out of 86. And then we have Jose Sa out of 91. Even Fabio Silva in the bench is out of 89. And then shout out to our boy Gomez out of 82. Still growing a lot. But boys, at this point, I don't know who to sign. But that is a problem for next season. Who was our top goal scorer? And it's going to be Pedro Neto with 34 goals. Chiquinho right behind him with 29. While Joe Felix has 21. And Fabio Silva, the bench warmer, has 18. Top assist was Pedro Neto with 17 and Ruben Neves right behind him. Okay, boys, another season, no Champo win. Let's go to the next season. Two. Okay, boys, take a look at the squad. What I said in the past became real. We have the whole Portuguese national side in one team. Boys, at this point, I think I have to go for Nuno Mendes and just play my right back because that is the only position we need to improve. With 285 million, there's really no one else to sign, man. We have the best Portuguese players in the game. But let's go ahead and sign Nuno Mendes. It wouldn't hurt. Okay, boys, we have successfully added Nuno Mendes to the squad as a right back. Okay, boys, this is season number six. Come on, boys. This has to be the year. Two finals in a row. Let's make it three, but win it this time. Okay, boys, season number six. This has to be a one. No way we reach another final and don't win it. A little simple title once again. You know what? It's pretty easy. Mini Shield, can we win that once again? And yes, three years in a row. FA Cup, can we win that as well? We lost to Liverpool. Carabao Cup? No domestic trouble, but a domestic double this time. But you know what? It's okay we didn't win the domestic trouble because we're going to win the actual trouble once we win the Champions League right now. Group C, come on. We passed the group. Yes, we did with 15 points. Run at 16. We went ahead and beat Leverkusen 4-3. Quarters, we beat Milan 4-1. Semis, we beat Tottenham. We're against Atletico in the final. Please, boys, come on. Let's go, boys. We have finally done it. 2 1 against Atletico. The Portuguese national team or Wolves have won the Champions League. Boys, we can finally end up this video as we signed one Portuguese player every season and Wolves won the Champions League. It took six seasons, but we basically built the Portuguese national side with the best Portuguese players in FIFA. Shout out to two players in this video Chiquinho for reaching a 92. He probably had no potential at the start, but he played so many games. And Gomez, who reached an 82 as well. But, boys, signing one Portuguese player every season until we won the Champions League has been a success. Make sure to check out my last video. I did build Mohamed Salah's dream team in FIFA 20 to career mode.